Good morning and a very warm welcome to a fairly overcast day in West Dean. However, we're here to show you around a really beautifully presented three slash four bedroom semi-detached home in the lovely quiet little close wayside. So start out the front here where you have the well-proportioned single garage dead ahead, an attractive front garden with a couple of steps up to the front door. What we really like about these styles of properties is that you have this wonderful terrace that's been created over the top of the garage, which actually gets a ton of sun and provides some wonderful views towards the South Downs. And it's such a little quiet road that it's very peaceful considering just how close you are to everything that Brighton and Hove has to offer. So let's take you inside as our clients have been here for many, many years, but the property is in absolutely superb condition having been renovated in the time that they have been here. Got a nice big double glazed picture style window at the front and then this wonderful living room with the parquet flooring underfoot and a very quirky fireplace which uh, adds a real hint of character to the home. And then across the hall you have the very recently replaced modern kitchen which has a fabulous sort of breakfast bar slash island feature in it as well. Almost fully integrated with some other white goods in the utility room, which I'll show you later. But uh, plenty of storage, built-in fridge freezer. Again, a nice window out looking towards the South Downs. And the views just sort of get better and better as we go up the floors. So uh, really, really nicely positioned, I must say. But uh, nothing to do in the kitchen really nicely put together and say plenty of space for perhaps a little breakfast table as well and we come through and this lovely flooring runs the whole way through the ground floor and then big amount of storage under the stairwell that goes all the way back and along with a little rail as well wonderful archway leading you through to the rear of the home where we have a downstairs wc which of course very very important and then one of the most underrated but most important rooms in the house, which is the utility room. So got your washer dryer in there. And then situated at the rear here, this is a fabulous room. So such a versatile space. This could be a, another bedroom. So this could be the fourth bedroom on the ground floor. Could be an office, a study, a formal dining room. It's got this fabulous uh, characterful fireplace in it. Nice flooring underfoot. That of course could also be a really, really good work from home space. So it's tucked away in the corner, but a fabulous room and a great addition to the home. So let's take you upstairs now and we'll show you around the first floor accommodation. So quite traditionally up here, you have three further bedrooms and the family bathroom. You also have quite a vast loft space above you, which may have potential to be extended into subject to the necessary planning consents. And this is what I mean about the views. Say, a shame it's a bit of a miserable day today, but the views on a sunny day up here, you can just imagine, are absolutely stunning. Got plenty of built-in storage in this double room. And all very nicely neutrally decorated with uh, fairly new carpets underfoot as well. And let's just talk a little bit about the location. Obviously, West Dean, you've got some wonderful schools, including West Dean Primary. You've got great bus routes and, of course, transport links via the A23, A27 as well. So it's an incredibly accessible location. Another good size double. These two bedrooms are virtually interchangeable, but we'll call this one the principal room just because it's situated at the rear. You've got tons and tons of built-in storage and a really clever sort of built-in dressing area as well with this great big mirror, which accentuates the light and the feeling of space. Really nice feature put in by our clients. And then all the rooms are serviced by a relatively modern family bathroom with separate shower as well. So got a great big full length bathtub, partial tiling throughout, a heated towel rail, and then a very handy oversized shower as well, which uh, there's these lovely panels behind it, which are nice and easy to clean and uh, some extra storage too. So really, really well appointed both uh, on the ground floor and the first, but what we'll do now, just show you the final bedroom, which is, again, a small double, but a, a very, very comfortable single with built-in storage as well. And then we'll take you outside and show you around the rear aspect of the home. 
So here we are. So just like the main house, the external areas have had an awful lot of attention paid to them as well. Got a large area of, uh, sort of side access, shall we say, that comes through this wonderful multicolored uh, paving underneath. So great big patio area. Whole garden's been quite heavily landscaped actually to provide a really useful and usable garden space for a growing family. So plenty of areas of sun, got some artificial grass which has been leveled across different tiering points plenty of space for some rattan furniture and alfresco dining as well if you wish and a little barbecue spot and then some raised beds for veg and uh, other plants etc at the rear so it's a very very good size garden and, and very much low maintenance and suitable for all so this is wayside if you'd like to have a look please do give us a call we'd love to hear from you